guys, this is Kay the Messy Soper over at Royal Appleberry and today I decided to pop in and film an impromptu video. Um, it's after 7 on a Monday. I normally don't even make so during the week but um, today was kind of a different day for me and I don't know, I guess I just need some soap therapy and I wanted to kind of talk to you all. Um, so before we just start with that. This is a remake, and that's another thing. I don't even film remakes, but today I decided to film just because I felt, you know, I wanted to talk to you all. I wanted to be with my stinking awesome crew. I really did. So this video will go up this week. Um, just because there was a couple of announcements as well. The fragrance I am using is Rustic Essentials Ming Fern and Lavender this soap is probably my number two in sales it sells out very well it smells amazing and you guys know i don't even like lavender but this ming fern and lavender is amaze balls together um i know you guys probably can't see the color in here and i didn't even mix it up <laughs> um i got some pistachio mica from rustic essentials I have some Purple Passion Mica for most Essentials. I need to get some more of both of these because they're almost out. Um, yeah, so that's what I'm going to be using. And I should probably mix this up. Um, I know some people are going to ask. These cups came from the Dollar Tree. Um, I always get asked about my colorful cups. And this little mini frother came from Amazon. I think it was like, I want to say seven bucks if that. <laughs> um, ooh, that's a beautiful purple. So also I am going to switch up the design just a little bit on this soap. It's been the same for so many years and there's nothing wrong with it. But sometimes I get bored. It's going to be the same colors. I think I'm going to switch up the pour and the top design. So um, I'm going to go ahead and split that off. The base is still going to be titanium dioxide. I should probably switch hands because my carpal tunnel is acting up quite a lot. It's just kind of hard for me to hold onto these cups. So I think that's all right there. Yeah, okay, so. Okie dokie. So now I got that smacked down pretty good. And I really need to wash my soap dishes because uh, these little tiny spatulas are not working for me. And this fragrance does uh, help loosen trace, which I do love. Here comes Gabriel, watch. <laughs> I hear him coming down the stairs. I think he's like, what in the hell is she's making soap? <laughs> Talk to you, here he comes. <laughs> <laughs> you think I'm talking to myself? I'm filming. I thought you were building the house. No. That's what I told them you were coming down here. You probably heard me down here banging around. I am making a soap. I just felt like making a remake. So she got a little bit of. It is. Look at you, buddy. Think you know something? That's exactly what it is. Alright, so, yeah, this fragrance does loosen trace, so, um, so we get runny, which is absolutely fine. So, I don't know if I want to make this super tall or just save some and put in a little separate mold. Don't know! Okay, and also, um, if you guys remember when I did the giveaway, um, not me, but I was telling you guys about How to Look Pretty, the company that is based out of California who uh, does the giveaways of the beautiful botanicals. They're doing another giveaway and I will be decorating my soap. I'll show you guys as soon as I'm done um, putting the top on this soap. 
but um, they have lovely, lovely botanicals. And all right, so yeah, my memory card died. <laughs> I mean, my memory card died. My memory card was full, so I decided to go ahead and um, put this soap, uh, get it put up here, because. I'm sure you guys don't want to sit and watch me scrape my cups. So, um, I figured while I was waiting for this to set up some, because it did need to set up some, I would just kind of bring um, the giveaway, part of the giveaway in as well. So again, the company is called How to Look Pretty, which is right here. I've actually done a review for them before. I really do like their products a lot. I'm not going to lie, I really, really do. Because, you know, sometimes you get dried botanicals and the colors aren't as vibrant, you know, as you would like for them to be. But these colors are super vibrant. So I do like that. And you can tell they're fresher flowers. And however they're dried, they were dried nicely. That way they retain their colors. So, um, what, uh, what I got here, I'm trying to do both. <laughs> Let me move this over and finish texturing this and then I'll tell you about how to look pretty. But be sure to head over and join that um, the giveaway so you can get some of these bot botanicals for yourself. She does quite a few giveaways and I mean you really should go and um, it's be sure to support her Facebook, all her social media really, but the uh, giveaways take place on um, her Facebook page and uh, the last winner was actually one of my subscribers so that was pretty awesome. Um, <laughs> so yeah definitely go over there and um get yourself in that giveaway and be sure to get yourself a rustic essentials giveaway as well so you can get yourself some nice free goodies what's better than free <laughs> i don't know i like free and um hmm trying to think yeah i think that just trying to it's sometimes hard to texture <laughs> these when I make them so tall but I love my tall soaps and in a minute I'm not gonna care because I can just um, sort that out later yeah that's what I'm gonna do so I'm gonna take this skewer here and just kind of blend things in so they'll match and then I'll take a spoon and press it down one more time and then I'll be done messing with this soap. And then I can tell you all about the giveaways. So I'm going to press that in one more time. And there's a reason why I'm putting these divots in here. Because it's my design that I'm going to do. It's going to make sense. Okay, so I'm going to push that to the side for a second. Now, so what I have here from How to Look Pretty. Again, be sure to go over to the Facebook page and uh, join in that giveaway. So yeah, how to look pretty, um, go over to her Facebook page, she does lots of giveaways there. What I got in this package this time, is very similar to the one I got last time. I got some lavender buds, so I'm not going to open this and put it on my soap. I'm actually going to use the ones that I got from her before, which are right here. You see how nice and pretty and purple that is? And um, I got some, I believe these are lilies. Yeah, I'm pretty sure, certain these are lilies. I grow these in my front yard. Um, I got some more peonies. I got some pink roses right here. I got some hibiscus right here. And then I have some uh, forget-me-nots or what is this called? Sylvetica. Sylvetica. Um, it's in the same family according to the card. So yeah, you will get a packet of these. Not necessarily these. You may get these or you might get a different packet. Because I do have a lot of the other ones. But this is what I got and I love it. So I'm going to use the lavender. And then I also um, mixed up some regular sea salt and makeup. So I'm going to bring my salt back in here. And then I'm just going to take my fingers and then try to stay in the middle because that's like way too much. <laughs> yeah, so yeah, put that right down the middle. I don't know why I want a lot of this. Just feel like it should be a lot, you know what I mean? Okay. And then I'm going to add a few lavender buds because it is lavender soap. And I am going to take this glove off because uh whew, getting kind of hot. Alright. Take a few lavender buds, nothing crazy. 
and then sprinkle those on as well they kind of blend in so i don't even know maybe oh yeah go down the side so it doesn't blend in with the sea salt put quite a few lavender buds on this i'm feeling heavy-handed today so there's nothing wrong with that and then i'll add a wee bit of glitter i'm not sure if i want purple glitter or white glitter no i'm gonna do white i got enough purple going on here so I'm going to take this spoon with the purple mic on it and get this glitter. Yeah, real, real dumb. But anyway. <laughs> oh, that's lovely. Oh, that's really lovely. I love it. Yes. I'm going to show you guys up close. Isn't that pretty? And it smells so fan fantastic. It really, really does. So yeah, that's my remake of my Twisted Lavender, which is scented with Rustic Essentials, Ming Fern and Lavender, which I love this fragrance. It is just delightful. It really, really is. All right, guys, um, stick around because the cutting is attached to this video as well. All right, so we are back for the cutting and this is what the top looks like. This needs to go with just, I'm going to cut it on this side. Um... Get that out of there. And today is April. What is today? April. I believe today is the 12th? 15th? What is it do? <laughs> so this will be ready on my website um, the 12th or 15th of May that week. Oh, that's beautiful. I'm so glad I decided to change the, um, the design on this. This is really pretty already. And I'm telling you guys, this is by far, just because I don't even like lavender, but I love, 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 and love, love this fragrance. It smells so good. I just can't even, uh, I'm really going to have to buy this in a bigger size. I get a pound? Did I have a pound? No, this last one I didn't have a pound. I had eight ounces. Yeah, I'm going to have to get two pounds just so I won't run out. That turned out lovely. I really like the way it looks. Oh, that's cool. So pretty. Yes. Very happy that I decided to change the design. Hope you guys are having a fantastic day. Um, like I said, today is April. Let me look and see what day it really is. This is kind of annoying to me. <laughs> day is actually April 12th, like I said. I guess I was looking at something, a meeting I have on the 15th. But, um, yeah. So this will be ready May 12th. And, um, ooh, I should not touch that. And it is beautiful outside, guys. It's like 71 degrees outside right now. Isn't that crazy? And then it's going to go back down. Yeah. Be sure to click on the links below to enter into those giveaways. Get yourself some goodies from How to Look Pretty. That's gorgeous. Absolutely. if my wrist looks a little bit weird <laughs> it's because I had on an ace bandage because of my carpal tunnel but it is getting better um, I learned that if you use if you take magnesium magnesium and B12 it'll actually stop your carpal tunnel from hurting within 24 hours I was watching I think his name is Dr. Josh Axe from the doctors he has a YouTube channel so I Pinterest it and found him and which I follow him anyway I think I said this already I'm not sure but however um, yeah so it actually does work so I'm feeling loads better I'm gonna trim this little piece off later but um yeah this turned out nice I love the new design I really do like it so much better and then I mean it had been that way for three years so it was time for a change I want to go sit on the porch and just enjoy this nice weather Hopefully Gabe gets off early and we can go for a walk. That would be great. So I'm trying to walk more. Although my knee has been giving me issues. Um, it's feeling better today as well because I know <laughs> this sounds like an ailment video. <laughs> but I've been taking uh, glucosamine um, with the uh, magnesium and B12 and it has helped my knee as well. So... That is so hilarious. I tell you, getting older. 
fun times <laughs> not really but yeah so hopefully we can go for a little bit of a stroll i'll be sure to put my knee brace on just to avoid any extra agitation now oh, that one's really pretty that top is so fun just love it oh that smells wonderful and i am hoping and praying that i get accepted into Sterling Fest. Like I said, our fair is like massive. Thousands upon thousands upon thousands of people attend every year. So I've submitted my app and I'm just waiting to hear back. Very pretty. And then I remember to push down my salt, my buds, so that way they're not falling off like, you know, like mad. So, it's even nicer. And thank you for tuning in. Thank you for heading over to the giveaways to enter. And thank you for always watching. You know, I love you guys. I sure do. And those of you who are new to my channel, hello. I am so fucking happy that you tuned in. So glad you found me. Hopefully you want to stick around. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button so you can become a part of our stinking awesome crew. Because my subscribers are just that stinking awesome. I love you guys. I really, really do. You know that. I always tell you that. And um, if you want to get notifications of whenever I post new videos, all you got to do is hit that bell. It's somewhere along there. I can never we can remember. I think it's on this side. Yes. Um, but yeah, go ahead and hit that bell. And then that way you'll get a notification and it can pop over whenever I post a new video, which is normally on Sundays. Um, so yeah, um, I guess that's it. And until the next old making video, I'll see you then. Bye.